Hi students, how are you? Welcome to our science class. Today we are going to learn about properties of materials. Again, properties of materials. Okay, please read your vocabulary words two times. Okay, first, hardness, hardness, scratches, scratches, ability, ability, withstand, withstand, stretch. Stretch, elastic, elastic, return, return, original, original, electricity, electricity, allow, allow. Shape, shape. Okay, next. Heat conductivity. Heat conductivity. Heat conductor. Heat conductor. Heat insulator. Heat insulator. Electrical conductivity. Electrical conductivity. Electrical conductor. Electrical conductor. Electrical insulator. Electrical insulator. Alright. Students, there are four properties of materials what are the four properties of materials first hardness next elasticity next heat conductivity and electrical conductivity these are the four properties of materials right what is hardness okay please read slowly hardness is the ability of the material to withstand scratches okay do you understand okay this one look at the picture Okay, for example, okay, look at the picture. These are examples of objects that are hard. Hardness from the word hard. Okay, for example, hammer is hard. This one. And knife is hard. Okay, this one, hard. All right, another property of materials is elasticity. What is elasticity? Okay, read slowly. Elasticity is the ability of the material to return to its original shape after being stretched. Hey, look at this picture. Right. These are examples of objects that are elastic. Elastic elasticity is from the word elastic. Okay. Look at this one. A rubber band is elastic. And a balloon is elastic. Right. 
Okay, another property of materials is heat conductivity. What is heat conductivity? Heat conductivity is the ability of the material to allow heat to pass through it. Okay, look at the picture. Okay. These are examples of objects that are good heat conductors. So one, a kettle is a heat conductor. Okay. And an electric iron is a heat conductor. This one. And some things are heat insulator. What is heat insulator? Okay, you read slowly. Heat insulator is a material that do not allow heat to pass through it. Okay, for example, so on. Okay, look at the picture. Materials such as wood, plastic, and rubber are heat insulator. Okay, these things are heat insulators. Wood, plastic, and rubber. Right. Another property of materials is electrical conductivity. What is electrical conductivity? Okay, read slowly. Electrical conductivity is the ability of the material to allow electricity to pass through it. Okay, look at the picture. This one example. Okay, this is metal. Okay, it will light up. Okay. All objects that are made of metal are electrical conductors such as copper wire. Nail, paper clip. Okay, they are all electrical conductors. Some things are electrical insulators. What is electrical insulator? Electrical insulator is a material that do not allow electricity to pass through it. All right, look at the picture. Pencil do not allow electricity to pass through it. Okay. All objects that are made of wood, plastic, and rubber are electrical insulators. Hey, okay, look at this picture. They are electrical insulators. Okay. All right, let's practice, students. Question What property of a material? Does a paper clip have? Right, I will give you three counts. Choose your answer A or B. One, two, three. Right, the answer is letter A. It's electrical conductivity. A. Next, 
what property of a material does a rubber band have? Okay, I will give you three counts. Choose your answer A or B. One, two, three. All right, the answer is letter B. It's elasticity. Very good. Okay, next. What property of a material does a metal roller have? Okay, I will give you three counts again. Choose your answer A or B. One, two, three. All right, the answer is letter B. Very good. It's hardness. Okay, which is a good electrical conductor? A paper clip or an eraser? Okay, choose your answer A or B. I will give you three counts. One, two, three. All right, the correct answer is letter A. It's a paper clip. Very good. Okay, next. Which is a good electrical insulator? A knife or a pencil? Okay, choose your answer A or B. I will give you three counts again. One, two, three. All right, the correct answer is letter B. It's a pencil. Very good. Next, which is a good heat insulator? A chopping board or a metal roller? Okay, I will give you three counts. Choose your answer A or B. One, two, three. All right, the correct answer is yes, letter. A. It's a chopping board. Very good. Okay, class. That's all for today. Don't forget to answer your worksheet. See you again next time. Bye-bye.